What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I'm trying out a new picture profile today with this new Sony camera. So if you guys like it, make sure you let me know in the comment section below. What we are going to be doing today is installing a set of hood struts onto the 86. And the only reason for this guys, I just get kind of sick of, I'm always opening the hood on this thing. And I just get kind of sick of always putting up the hood um, prop. So I picked up a set of hood struts. They are carbon fiber. Of course, I like a lot of carbon fiber. So let me unbox these things real quick and I will show you guys what they look like. So here they are right here. Looking pretty good. These things are pretty damn beautiful. There's the car. Still looks the same as it always does. Still have the tow hook in there because I don't know. I just haven't taken it out yet. Still full of snow. Still full of snow. If you have not seen that video of installing these other carbon fiber pieces, those carbon fiber door cups, I'd highly suggest you guys go check it out. I need to talk about what the next or the future plans are for this car. Maybe I'll do that after I install these hood struts. There's actually a few things I want to talk to you guys about eventually on the channel. Uh, one, like I just said, future plans for the 86, future plans for the Evo, and there, I always get asked about like YouTube income and YouTube earnings, and I kind of wanted to show you guys what YouTube pays me. It's not that much, but I'll, I'm always transparent with you guys, so I probably will show you in a video. But let's go ahead and rip these things open and get these gorgeous things installed onto the cute little car we got here. So using my 12 millimeter socket and my ratchet, I'm gonna go ahead. this top bolt is what we're gonna be using, so. You can loosen that up and then so on the passenger side of the car right now i'm grabbing the one that says right hood they also sent us some washers as well but i don't really see them being necessary try to get that on as straight as possible after we get that top plate on we're gonna have to bolt the bottom one on and that's gonna bolt through that bolt right there so use your 10 millimeter and rip off that bolt bolt the plate on facing that way so the little nub will be up here and then we can get the gas strut on itself. All right, guys, we got both mounts on top and bottom. And now it's time to get the gas strut on. The next thing we need to do is pull off these little clips right here. So they're on both ends of the little gas strut itself. Simply just clip them off like that, and then they'll slide out. All right, I'm going to get the top on first. So it just simply slips onto there. I already pre-greased it using the grease that they sent us. Now I need to pull the bottom clip off ah. and do the same thing. From here, I'm gonna take off my easel tags that say hood and fender on them. You can leave them on if you want, but I think they're kind of ugly. So I'm going to take them off. All right, the last step is to remove our stock little hood prop. So bend it toward the front of the car. And as you can see, it falls right out. Super easy to remove. Just close the hood, open it up, make sure everything works like it should. As you can see, I made it so it opens a lot farther than factory. And look how nice and clean it is without the hood prop in here. It's awesome. As you can see, it's closed perfect. That is super nice. Gotta love it guys, gotta love it. Now it says in the instructions you cannot use this with a lightweight hood or carbon fiber hood, but guys you can just use one one strut on the one side and nothing on the other side and it'll work fine i guarantee it so if you guys want to pick a set of these up i'll have the carbon fiber and just regular ones linked down in the description box below so make sure you guys go use those links they're super super helpful and as you can see the carbon fiber on them just looks incredible so very very clean very nice looking now the next few videos you guys can be expecting on the channel of this car. I need to throw some badges on it. 
Honestly, I think I'm gonna do Toyota badges. I know it's the Scion guys, it's an FRS, but they're the same thing. Trust me, they're pretty much the same DM car. So I think I'm gonna do Toyota badges on it. Uh, I still gotta build my side skirts for it, for the bottom of the Rallybacker kit. I wanna do some sort of duck bill on it. I'm still waiting on APR mirrors. My APR wing, I spilled the beans. I got an APR wing. Um, and then I think I'm gonna do a trunk clip as well, a carbon fiber small little trunk clip to a cup accompany the wing is that what it doesn't even sound right to go along with the wing so it should look pretty insane back there uh diffuser i gotta throw on my diffuser i got exhaust on the way i gotta put on so quite a lot more content coming for this car got a tint of windows and that should be pretty much it for like aesthetic stuff interior wise i'm doing a 11 inch touchscreen radio one of my sponsors, Brom, sent me a set of seats for this car, so I got to install the seats still. And I got, I have to get all this done within a week because I am leaving for Seattle. I live in Spokane. There's a meet in Seattle at Spring Fest 2018. If you, any of you guys are going there, let me know. I would love to meet some of you guys. But there's the meet, Spring Fest 2018, that I'm going to in Seattle, bringing this car, of course. So I need to get all that stuff done within a week. Should be very very doable anyways if you enjoyed the video make sure you hit that subscribe button i can't even talk it's so freaking cold out my mouth is frozen hit that subscribe button right up in that corner and if you guys really enjoyed the video just hit that share button down below really would appreciate it thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you in tomorrow's video tomorrow i think we're gonna throw some badges on this car and maybe i'll attempt to little story guys i ordered center caps work vsxx center vsxx yeah is that how it said center caps for these wheels and they don't fit for some reason so i gotta figure out what's going on there but i think that's what we're doing tomorrow is some badge stuff see you guys then